From what I understand, they don't really come out, Barnacle. So they actually can kind of sleep for several months. So they actually sleep for a very long time. That's why they're fattening up so much. They're not really supposed to. They're not really supposed to wake up. I should skip Solar, go straight to nuclear. No, 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 no. I don't think they come out until after the stream. So basically, like, when it's dark out, that's kind of when they start roaming. Now, to be fair, it does get dark at, like, freaking 4 p.m. at this point, at this time of the year. It's kind of nuts. I feel like it's been getting dark really early lately, but... Anyways, um, yeah, it's a lot of effort. We'll see. Maybe next year. Yeah, I gotta be careful I don't turn them into radioactive hedgehogs. Infrared is dangerous, no? Okay, so I can go back over here. Oh, this is where I needed you some time ago. Yeah, you wanted to... That's what I mentioned, but... If I get bitten by a hedgehog, I will become hedgehog, man. Yeah, absolutely. Hedgehogs are remarkably cute, though. I never really thought about hedgehogs very much, but they are really cute little animals. I love how their entire defensive strategy... Like, they, they have not specced into, into any sort of offense at all, okay? Like, if they hear any sort of trauma, any sort of drama coming... They just sit there and they just put their backs out. That's all they do. They have specced full into defense. That's an interesting tech choice, no? A lot of animals spec into glass cannon instead. If I was an animal, I think I would spec into glass cannon personally, but... Yeah, they do a thorn build. Thorn builds aren't very popular in the IRL meta, but some animals really have nailed it. Yeah, they have a portable bunker. Yeah. No, 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 their quills are not toxic. What are we doing, guys? <laughs> One of the... Like, the big boy hedgehog was definitely a little toxic, though. The big boy hedgehog did not want the others to eat until, you know, he was done eating and all that. He, he had a bit of an attitude. So I guess he was technically a toxic hedgehog, but that's not quite what you're saying. Uh... Okay. Is it a Void Ray? It's an arena? No. It does have some very strong military vibes somewhere. What is going on? Oh, okay. I can hold down the button. Oh, okay. I do have to land after hitting one, I guess. And I seem to only be able to launch from here. Okay. Alright. This is a key or a lock router that has four keys. There's something inside of that thing. Thank you, Arca Light, for the 53 months. Appreciate it. Ooh, it's a giant widow mine. 
Is this the spider that we had earlier? Okay, this one's yellow. So did that give me a boost? Oh, we got its... Oh my god. I just killed one of its legs. Okay, so we're looking for the one with the yellow glow. Oh no. Snap. Okay, don't touch the audience! Whoa, 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 whoa. Shit, shit, shit. Oh, I made it. No, loco, fuck. The turn rate of this thing is not very fast! Okay. Is there anything that's yellow? God, I'm stuck. I'm screwed. <laughs> not screwed. Ah, there's one that's yellow. Bait it. Bait it. Little did he know, I am the master at baiting. They call me the master baiter. Oh, he's got only two legs now. Okay, here's another one of those rings. I prefer, oh God. No. Ooh. Fuck. Oh, not dead. I don't know how I didn't die there, but fair enough. <sighs> Is this the yellow one? No. Ah, there's yellow. Yikes. No, Loco. Loco, you idiot. You flew too far. Am I still on time? I still am on time. He's got one leg. A spider with one leg? Weird. I guess it was never a spider in the first place, but it does look like some sort of animal that they would have in Australia. Like, if this animal existed anywhere on Earth, it would be in Australia, let's be real. Here's yellow. Boom! Nice. Yeah, I don't know what the earth is. The uh, the ground here is some sort of wriggly worm type of thing. Um, I think I have to, uh... Do I go and grab every single one of the balls? Uh... More of those black diamonds. I don't know what they are. I've come across a load of them right now. I did tear the legs off of that spider. I did, yeah. I'm the good guy. Okay. Again, very creative, but to what purpose? Yeah, now we, okay.
Beautiful little game, dude. Okay, so we have become Navi. Can I bounce it? Sure. Interesting. I guess we can bounce it off of that then? Still new game mechanics are being introduced, man. Rarely do they reuse game mechanics, it seems. Or at least a lot of animations and... How would I go about doing this? Can I bounce it off of that pillar? Is it possible for me to bring this thing back and then bounce it off of that thing? I guess? I don't know if that's in the right position, but it does look like it would be. So I guess we just shoot it straight left and prepare to go up. Oh, hell yeah. Okay. Do me, Harstam, and you thermal hang out outside of StarCraft 2 events? Not really, no. We live in the same apartment building, though. Grubby lives upstairs. Rotterdam lives downstairs. It's great. No, that's a lie. I'm sorry. Raynor makes the pizzas? Absolutely, yeah. Kalazura is here somewhere, too. Do Americans also hang out together? Absolutely, yes. All Americans in the chat know each other on a personal level. That's how it goes. It's like the Kala. They're all connected. No, most of the StarCraft 2 content creators kind of just do their own thing in their own little bubble. We've tried several times to get that to, like, unbubble a little bit with, like, group chats and hang it. I don't know. It doesn't really happen. Everybody's just kind of doing their own thing. Not as much as communication as, you know, would be nice, but... Oh. Okay. Can confirm, Loco, we do. Yeah. Come here, ball. What else can I do over here? Does this do anything for me? <laughs> yeah, StarCraft 2 people just sit at home and are too busy to socialize. Absolutely. Single-player gamers turn out to be single-player gamers. Does it do me any good if I move this? I don't know, but it's possible. That's cool, I guess. <laughs> I could even put multiples in there, I guess. I 
I've trapped the ions. Yeah. Oh, you know what? This is what I need to do. Yes, this is what I need to do. And then I need to use the... Then I need to free it. The theory was good anyways. Okay, here we go, here we go, we got it now. Here we go, here we go. Ooh, okay, I made it. Woo, nice. Thank you very much, Thalric. Welcome back. Why are there spikes? I think I preferred the tentacles over the spikes. The spikes look a little angry. Whoa. Oh god, there's a giant boss man behind me. Uh. Ah! I'm not good at this. This is for gamer gamers. I'm not a gamer gamer. Okay, that went really well. <laughs> Fuck, this is gonna be tricky. I'm not very good at these things. I have to predict where they're going to be, but there was like a thingy blocking me. Ah, oh, jeez. Do you think if I get one, it resets the timer? Hopefully. Oh, dude, that twirly thingy makes it so confusing. Ah! Fuck. The thing in the background, is it a friend or not? Absolutely not, no way. We might be here a bit. Because my timing is not great for this sort of stuff. I don't know how many layers there's going to be to this. Oh. Okay. Fuck. <laughs> that wasn't even close. <laughs> ah, no. I'm doomed, dude. That went worse than the first time around somehow. There's a little swirly thingy in the middle that blocks the attacks. That was a hit for sure, dude. The heck? I'm gonna hit one this time around. New goal. Hey, Loco, how are your balls? <laughs> Great, man. Thank you. I'm more of a diamond guy now, apparently. Dude, I struggle. Oh my god, this is hard. Thank you, Freshenomics. It's easier than throwing a successful fungal growth. 
Is it though? Thank you, Freshonomics, for the tier three resub. That's the big boy sub. With that sub, Freshonomics tells everybody, I'm cooler than you. And yeah, yeah, you you'd be right, yeah. I need to just ignore the swirly thingy. What? That was bullshit. Okay. Did I do it? I don't know if there's more. I'm a fire my laser! Ultimately, I become a Void Ray. Is that the game? We're trying to become a Void Ray? No, no, no. We, we had a red spell, not, not an Avada Kedavra. Is this God? God, what are you doing? You've trapped one of my bulls. Whee! Dude, this game. There is, like, no repetition, man. Like, all of these transitions and all that are sick. Is that my cat, or was that the game? I'm hallucinating. Hallucination has begun, Chet. I thought I heard my cat meow right in front of my door. Uh, that was no cat. I opened the door. I'm hearing voices right now. Yeah. Becoming completely delu delusional on stream. Can I still go back to the green world? Sure. What about the white world? Sure. I can nest the green ball in the white ball. I don't know why I would do that, but... It's an option. You may be delusional, but at least you're not a Void Ray. That's true. That's what I've been trying to avoid, Ray. All this time. Wait, avo no, avoid. Ray. Um... What else can I do? What did Ray to, uh, do to me? I don't know anybody now, Ray. Or, or Cold Ray. I think the odds of you being a Protoss player when your name is Ray, though, do go through the roof. A question humanity has been asking itself for a while now. Can we go back to the green world? Oh, we can. The main question is whether or not we will be on it. Much more fun question. Um, so I can travel back and forth. Is there anything that I can do over here that I didn't already do? Yeah, I have not used this tower. I remember this section. We have not used a lot of these things. If I had the orange globe, I could go across this bridge as well. I don't think I ever did that. Maybe I did, but there were some things here that I... Where is my orange ball, chat? I guess the god took it, right? Yeah, I think so. 
He seemed to at least confiscate it. I'm not sure exactly what he did with it. Man, imagine waking up and God takes one of your balls. That'd be a weird situation. Then he, yeah, adds it to his face? Yikes. Uh, I don't know what I can do. Nothing seems to happen. Oh. Oh, this is a different thing. Uh, for science? The white ball can shoot. <gasps> I remember these things. Oh shit, okay. Remember I tried hitting that thing a bunch of times and it never worked? That is a very neat mechanic. I have seen probably, a, a, yeah, probably like three or four of these. I gotta move it now to the other side. Dude! I really like how clever these things are. Cause like, these weird shapes in the environment, you kinda look at them and you're like, oh yeah, that's weird. Why is there that diamond looking thing? Whatever, there's so many weird shapes in this game. May as well just ignore it. It seemed important, but I couldn't do anything with it. This is uh, quite a bit of time ago in the game that we were here. So we're going back into the green world. Hmm. Very seamless. Yeah, it's very creative, absolutely. Pretty cool. I don't know exactly what we're doing here, but... I guess I want to make them all like so, and then we grab the green ball somehow? Yeah, but how do I have the green ball while also... Can I go up and down with the white ball? I don't even know if I can go there in the first place. No. What about this thing? What does this thing do? That's just a little holder. So these are the shooter shoots? Looks like this thing over here on the right, by the way, is no longer accessible. I guess that means I still have use for the other two? Okay, we're gonna go back. And I'm gonna move the platform all the way back around. I don't know if this does anything different now. No, I think it achieves the exact same thing. I guess there's maybe a way for me to interact with some of these objects, but I'm not 100% sure. Yeah, this pillar also changes. Looks like I'm gonna need to get the red orb again, but I don't know where to get it. 
All of these also adjust. I don't think I'm in reach of any of these things, am I? Um, I don't think I can go all the way back. So normally you can go up and down on these pillars. Problem is... Is there anything Love I can do in this be. world? What's going on, Boiler? Thank you. Appreciate you. So normally in order to go up and down these pillars, in the green world, y you need the green ball. So the little thingies over here at the front of its spin, there's one over here in the back as well. All of these pillars seem to have those little flower things. So these also change, but like, how does that help me out? I can't reach them. I don't think there's much I can do. The ones outside the ball were also changing? Really? Nah, no, this, is, this isn't doing any good. I need to move it back to where I just was. Let's see. Oh, these are also changing. Oh, that's what we're trying to do. Oh, that's really clever. I mean, I don't really know exactly how this necessarily helps me out, but I can use it over here to change these pillars as well. I don't know which one I want to move on, though. They may be the same pillars. Yeah, they may be the exact same pillars. Because there are many of the pillars set up over here. I don't remember what mode they were in though when I first got into this room. So can I use this to travel up as well without the ball? I guess that's the idea, right? Yeah. But like now what? Hmm. Sometimes in this game, it's kind of tricky to decide what you're trying to achieve. You're trying to progress. But since the puzzles are all very different, it's kind of difficult sometimes to figure out how to progress. So here's another one of those diamonds. Okay. Bring the balls. I don't know if maybe I should leave this one behind now. No, I need the white one up here. Don't I? Is there anything I can do over here with the white one currently?
Looks like there's three little platforms. How would I shoot this thing over here? I think that's what I need to do. But how in the world would I go about doing that? Is this activatable right now? I can. Okay. Um. I needed to come out from... That doesn't really matter. Hmm. Can I shoot the white ball at the green ball from up top? I don't think so. Because, yeah, no, that's not one of those... Like, you need one of those yellow outline things. It almost feels like it needs to bounce back in or something. It feels like I'm kind of missing something critical here. Can I activate these things straight up with the white ball? Oh, obviously I can just shoot with those. Right, that's something I can do. Oh, you know what? I need to get the white ball up there somehow. But I guess nesting them in one another doesn't really do me much, right? I think I can, but... Do I get the powers of the green one when it is... ...nested inside of the white one? Oh, I can't even go there anymore. I thought I could actually move them into one another, but apparently not the case. Game developers aren't, uh, aren't that mean, apparently. So I need to go up there. While holding the white ball. How in the world would I do that? Because we needed to shoot over here, but we also needed to shoot down below. Okay, maybe there's other things that I can shoot with it here. Yeah, maybe I can just move to the right instead. Or to the left or whatever. I don't know if there's anything here that I can hit. Um... This has got to be a very clever solution. Tricky one.
I am gonna need this thing to shoot for sure. Right now, the only thing I have not used, and that does not seem to be useful, is have this position on that thing over here. Like, why is this a thing that I can do? Because the one can shot from the left, one can shoot from the top. The right position does not seem to be important. What am I missing here? I'm missing something. This has got to be the solution. Yeah, I don't know. Oh! Can I shoot it from there instead? I can shoot it at the ball from here. Does that do me any good? No, that doesn't do me anything. Wait, does it? So it's still shooting in the world. So if I shoot it from here, nothing happens. Yeah, so the orb is still flying. The only way I can activate it is from here. So what I do is shoot and go up here. That is some big brain stuff over here. Very clever little puzzle. The fact that all of these worlds though exist simultaneously it's kind of unique. Like, that doesn't usually happen in puzzle games like that. Like, sometimes we see, like, a real-time update of it. What do I do here now, then? Uh, it makes sense, but... Still, still very tricky. Can I do anything over here? No. You were here? You were here, yeah. When my brain got slightly more wrinkly. It was a beautiful day. More wrinkles equals better, no? More wrinkles equals more super, uh, more surface area. So, one wrinkle is better than nothing. Absolutely. Thank you. Hey, green ball. Oh no, oh no, oh god, not this again. I can't hit it! What? They move! That is some bull heck over here. Oh, it wasn't rocket science, chat. You just needed to not be dumb. Well, remember when I said you needed to not be dumb? There we go. 
turns out I'm pretty dumb. <laughs> Are you gonna steal another one of my balls? Yeah, I'll give you another Void Ray Zap. There it is. Bzz, bzz. Do it. Do it, you won't. What am I doing? Am I playing? Playing the game. I can catch it? I think I have to bounce it back. We're basically playing ping pong. There you go. The developers of Pong would be very proud of that part. Give it back. This is one of my balls. Give it to me. Am I helping this guy or am I killing this guy? I can't figure it out. I guess if you have to ask, it's not a good sign. Maybe he's rewarding me? Speaking of rewarding me. <laughs> no, sorry, I won't. Sorry, no, 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 no. No, sorry. <laughs> Very subtle, right? <laughs> My sellouts are becoming more and more subtle. Yeah, thank you. Five dollars a month. So I can nest my balls inside of one another. Nice, right? Weird flex, I know. But it's an option. I'm just saying. Don't be jealous. Can one learn this power? I don't think you should aspire to, but I think you technically can. <laughs> alright, alright, alright. No more sellout, no more sellout. That was the only sellout you're gonna get all stream, guys. What's the point in me moving that ball across the bridge, if I can't be on it myself? Rukun! Welcome. You were gifted a sub by... a nickname that I cannot read. Shout out to the nickname I cannot read. Thank you for rewarding my bad behavior. Mrs. Admin said this game looks visually appealing and wants to play it. 
Is this the gateway? This might be the gateway, sysadmin. Before you know it, she's hooked to RuneScape and you will never see her again. Yeah, yeah, that's what she thought as well on, on you guys' first date. She's like, ooh, visually appealing. Terrible gameplay, but visually appealing nonetheless. <laughs> visually appealing over gameplay any day. You found someone on the old school RuneScape subreddit? With a similar name? Do you secretly play RuneScape? I knew it! Yeah, it was you. Stop lying. Stop lying. There's only one system administrator in the world. Everybody knows that. Hey, what's going on, Psycho? Hello. Yeah. 